what's going on you guys the lightweight division oh man it's been on fire 135 pound division the lighter weight guys the young guys in the sport of boxing have been going back and forth on twitter for the past 48 hours um Keyshawn davis versus this guy Shakur stevens versus that guy ryan garcia it is tank davis that everybody going back and forth devin haney they all going back and forth with each other right ryan garcia is now in the mix you know the twitter king ryan garcia and yeah um he spoke about the altercation that him and javante tank davis had in the club i think davis last night he saw ryan garcia at the club tank well, what was that like talking to ryan pushed up with my boy see where his energy was alike you know what i mean but he wasn't on shit he when they met now as we heard there's a fight that's potentially going down between these two guys right and ryan garcia details as to what happened uh with tank davis when they met in the club check it out she did see uh i seen tank in the club he's a tough guy he's a tough guy uh i went up to his table with me and this guy and we said uh yo are we gonna make this fight happen and uh, i guess he got offended by that got all worked up and i was like yo what you on about man it's like ain't no respect here and then he responds with nah there ain't no respect here i said oh it's like that Okay, it's like that. Okay, and then he tried to, he did, he, he grabbed my chain, but I wasn't worried about it. You know, there's so many security cards there. I knew he wasn't going to take my chain or do anything, really. He just wanted to seem tough. So I said, wow, it's like that, huh? And then he responded again, but yeah, it's like that. And then he let, well, he had to let go. And then I said, you know what, I'm going to, and then I said something to him. She knows what I said. <laughs> I'm not gonna repeat it on, on, on a lot, but just know, uh, you know, in the fight, that's where it really happens. Outside the ring, you can act tough all you want. Inside the ring, it all changes. It definitely does. I'm not with the, you know, acting tough. I'm tough only when I need to be. Wow, that's what Ryan had to say. So he said that Tank Davis G checked him in the club. Ryan tried to pull up on him tried to talk to him about the fight tank davis got offended and pretty much g checked him you know tried to take his chain etc 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 right come on man um <laughs> ryan garcia wasn't ready for that you could tell by his energy as he explained the story that he wasn't ready for that type of uh situation that type of that that, that gangster like situation he was not ready for that you know what i'm saying tank davis is all about that you know what i'm saying he's a street dude so yeah, Ryan Garcia is in the street, dude, and he felt a little bit weary in that situation. I already know what type of energy Ryan was displaying. He was probably nervous as shit, despite him being a world-class fighter. Um, but yeah, um, but Tank Davis, he responds to all this, right? He responds to it, and he pretty much says that Al Heyman and them had to get him up off, get him up off the situation, right? He explains that. He says this. Al told me to leave him because he went crying to his lawyer. Al got a little scared they was going to pull out of the fight. This is what Tank Davis says in response to this. Now, I don't have it on the screen, but I'll put it on the screen. Um, I think Tank Davis, you know, he liked to take tweets down. So he may have took this tweet down because I went and checked and um, I didn't see it. So, But I got it on the screen anyway for you because somebody else had it. And yeah, Tank Davis said Al told him to leave him alone because, you know, lawyers, etc. And Ryan might pull out of the fight so yeah um <laughs> oh shit man look man these dudes <sighs> hey they're keeping this shit interesting you know i don't expect any of these fights to happen other than ryan and tank i don't expect any of these other fights to really happen right just yet you know but maybe if tank and ryan happens maybe these other fights will happen sooner than later of course tank davis is closer to 30 now than he is to 20 so one may um imagine that tank davis would be looking to get a big fight here soon and that big fight of course is with ryan garcia but ryan garcia also is going back and forth with shakur stevenson he gives his thoughts on shakur stevenson's fight I, I don't, and I, I don't. he gives his thoughts on shakur stevenson's fight and yeah um check it out comment on a lot of fights but i'm not gonna lie guys that fight with shakur really it kind of got me a little little pissed off and not because shakur won or anything that's great he was supposed to win but it's the fact that he got away with the, the most low blows I've ever seen somebody get away with. And he does it a lot. And wow. 
So Ryan said that Shakur be low blowing a lot. And I've been seeing a lot of fans saying that Shakur um, do be low blowing a lot. And now from here going forward, even your boy Bushido is going to be looking at that to see if Shakur be hitting guys low. Nothing against Shakur, but you just can't throw that many low blows without realizing you're throwing low blows. And to me, you know, that ref just missed everything. It was, it was very, it was just it's a horrible display of fouls that you were just like, what? what is going on here? But again, nothing against Shakur, but man, you gotta, you gotta keep your punches up. I counted like a hundred of them. No, Shakur does not wash me. Stop it. Stop it. Does not. He can't even wash that other guy that he fought. But you should have got him out of there. He definitely can't wash me. Wow. <laughs> I love it. Okay. I love this trash talk and this back and forth between these young guns. And I'm going to be expecting these dudes to be fighting. I don't want to hear no ducking because when it's time to fight, it's going to be time to fight. Whatever you were trying to say, you're not knocking nobody out. Yeah. The worst thing he could do is jab you to death, I guess. Wow. He said, Shakur, Steven, the worst thing he could do is jab you to death. I mean, they've been taking shots at Shakur. Teddy Atlas been coming at Shakur Stevenson for his style. I guess I guess you could say Shakur Stevenson isn't going to be everybody's cup of tea. Um, it seemed like to me like he was really pressing the action in that fight, trying to get Kasinki out of there to make a, a good impression, but it just wasn't he was just wasn't able to get the job done. I mean, we gotta get Kasinki out a little credit too. I mean, come on, man. He wasn't just some guy, he was an Olympic gold medalist for uh, for fuck's sake, man. Come on. But he also, Ryan Garcia says this. Someone tell me why Shakur Stevenson gets so emotional. Guess the truth hurts at times. The best part of the last fight was when the final bell rang because it woke me up. Wow. Hi guys, People that like that as we speak. That is pretty funny. Uh, let me see what Shakur had to say in response to this. He says, Ryan, chin suspect. Tell him to shut up. He just a walk and come up. Everybody and they mama in line to cast a check for fucking him up. He's sweet for real. Dang. Let me see what else Shakur had to say. He said, my name buzzing right now, so you know the social media king got to add his two cents in. See, that's why I said Ryan Garcia is the Twitter king. That's what you see. You know, and Shakur Stevenson. So they're going back and forth, man. This thing probably ain't going to stop probably until tomorrow or something. I don't know. These guys are really in a whirlwind of uh, going back and forth with each other. Shakur Stevenson, Ryan Garcia, you know, Tank Davis, Ryan Garcia. They all going back and forth with each other on social media. It's interesting, you know. It ain't really no fights coming up, but these young fighters, um, I expect these dudes to fight. You know, they're doing a lot of talking, but I expect for them to do a lot of walking. Like, subscribe, hide your boy. Peace out.